Marn with Just Vegan In. Oh my gosh, I am so excited because we are gonna stuff our face with donuts at Need a Little Bakery here in Bethnal Green, East London, baby. And hey, if you're new to the channel, please make sure you subscribe because believe me, you do not wanna be missing out on these scrumptiously good times. So we have Archie, our donut extraordinaire. Honestly, his way of describing them is just so poetic. I was like, you don't want to hear it from me. You want to hear it from him. So Archie, take it away and tell us what we're eating today. So we're going to start just down here. Right over here, we've got a chocolate and blood orange donut, which is fantastic because blood orange is currently in season. And then right next to it is our rose and raspberry donut with a sort of rose and raspberry creme. And the nicest thing about it is the, the florality that really works with the tartness and the sweetness of the raspberry. Coming on next to it is our lemon and rosemary um, donut right here. Something that really is nice and that can jump between the uh, tartness of the lemon and the sweetness of the sugar is that rosemary, which again brings that little bit of florality. Next to it, we've got a fantastic pistachio donut, a real favorite of mine. Really, really strong nutty flavor, and then you have these little explosions of flavor right on top with that pomegranate seeds. And then right here at the end, a real favorite is gonna be our creme brulee donut. It's classic, it's unforgettable. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. We got sugar brulee on top with a vanilla cream inside, all vegan and all available here. Oh my gosh, I was just doing my happy dance. Okay, Whew, I know, I do get so, so excited about good vegan food, but like this place, hands down, the best vegan donut place in London. Oh my gosh, so one of the sisters, we didn't get a chance to meet her today because she is hard baking away. Whoa, she is a trained pastry chef and you taste it in every single bite. The fluffiness of those croissants, I have never had in any other kind of vegan croissant. It was like layers upon layers and you bit into it and it like melted in your mouth. And do not get me started. Those donuts! Whoa! My body is convulsing because it was so good. Every single one. You could tell they baked them here fresh daily. It was so fresh. The dough was, I mean, like I said, it was just delightful. It was like biting into a cloud. I know sometimes I've used those words before, but I'm like, this had every little inch of my body, my skin, my everything, just simply smiling. It was just delightful. And the flavors, they are so great, original, and what's good is they change the flavors seasonally, so you could come here at any time and try something new. Oh yeah, they do coffees, they do smoothies. If you live in the London area, they do deliver, they have an e-bike, so eco-friendly, baby. Wow, 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 wow. I honestly, I can't really sing this place's praises enough. And all I gotta say is you just gotta get yourself down here and try them out. Yes. All right, so I am here with one of the masterminds, Becca. This, what I love about Need a Little Bakery is it is a female run business. Oh yes, girl power. And even better, it is run by two sisters. So we have Becca here and you know me, I'm really nosy. So I wanted to ask her a few questions about this lovely establishment. What would you say the ethos is? So we like to make this space like as welcoming to everyone as possible. We're like not judgmental, we're really cozy. You can come in, sit down, stay all day, take away. With the vegan thing, like everyone, no one's alienated. Everyone can eat them, dairy free, whatever. Yeah, just everyone being welcome is our main kind of brand identity, I'd say. And our dogs allowed. Uh-huh, yeah. Yeah! 100%. Yeah, dog bowl outside every day. Yes. No worries. <laughs> and I got one last question, and you know I like to ask this one. What? This is going to be a hard one, and you yeah. could have multiples. <laughs> what on the menu, or which donut gives you your biggest vegan food orgasm? <laughs> I would say you can probably have multiples. the creme brulee. The creme brulee is probably the long-standing bestseller. It's just like a classic flavor that everyone loves the vanilla cream inside and the burnt, uh, burnt sugar on top. Just 
kind of you can't go wrong <laughs> amazing yeah. well thank you so much becca and thank you for bringing so much donut goodness here um to east london and london coming from the states i love donuts so yeah. And you're not always finding loads of good vegan ones, so like, thank you for doing that. <laughs> Anytime. And everyone, as always, thank you so much for watching, and please make sure you like, share, and subscribe <laughs> to Just Vegan In, and follow me on Instagram at Just Vegan In, and follow Need a Little Love as well. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>